he's going to go to the best team in the universe. It's going to make or break him, and hopefully it makes him. We never saw what was in that envelope. Did you rig it? If I would have rigged it, I would have said you, Ali. Come on! Hello, exciting times, my people. The season's come to an end, so we have to do a Front Threes award show. I'm Ali, I'm here with Jules and Juwan, and welcome back to the Front Three show! Woo! Front Threes, three by threes, league winners edition. Take it away. Let's go. <laughs> what the? All right, I'll go Barcelona, mm, PSG, I'll go... No, no, I'm gonna go Man City, Barcelona. Right, mate, no, but Man City, Barcelona, I'm gonna go uh, easy. So see it. Yeah. What the timer? Oh, timer. Five, four, you can't have that. Three, three two, two one. one. Thank you. <laughs> Barca, PSG. I'm gonna go Neymar. Let's start it off. Oh, that's oh, yeah, good. That's right, good. Right. That's not bad. It's a good start. Yeah. Mm. What have you got then? Yeah, he's right. Mm. I'm gonna go. Yeah, yeah. That's why you got the name there. <laughs> This is hard enough. I thought you You're stolen. That's crazy. Already. Shut up, let me think. If you shut up, let me think. I can think you <laughs> shut up. <laughs> Whoa. Uh, Bayern Munich, Napoli. I'm going to go... Five, four... No, wait. I'll go Benfica, Benfica, PSG, Di Maria. Cool. There we go. Yeah, nice. Watch this. Tactics, yeah? I'm telling you, because he's not going to get Barca and Napoli. It's fine. So Barca, Man City. I'm going to go Eric Garcia. Let's go. Let's see. It's a W right now. I promise you. I swear to God. <laughs> Get a timer, please. No, one second. Let me think. Give me a second. Barcelona, Napoli. Um... Do, you, do you have an answer for this? Of course I do. Uh, chill out. If you just it's... timer, guys. You have to have to break one set. No, there's a timer. Barcelona, Napoli. Five. Oh, I got this. Four. Pjanic. No, no. he never played for Napoli. Wait, I got it. No, no, that's his, that's his goal. That's it. Fair it's got to go next. So can what I go? Stupid so can I go? You got the what? wrong answer. Can I go? It goes on. Please, can yeah, I go? Take it away. I'm going to go for Diego Armando Maradona. Oh. Maradona. Guys, good. thank you. Bizu. That's that was so good. Come on! Listen, how was I meant to know Napoli and Barcelona, Diego Maradona? Broski, I wasn't even live back then. Neither was I. Just hear excuses. Anyways, we'll move on from that because it's time for the Front Threes Award Show! Woo! Woo! You guys excited? I'm looking forward to it, man. I love this game. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, we've got a bunch of awards to give away, so stay tuned. I'll be up first. The first award is the funniest moment of the season. The nominees are Richarlison. <laughs> Conte Handshake. And lastly, Jack Grealish and his Gucci bag. And the winner is... Thank you. Cheers, mate. Really? Antonio Conte and Thomas Tuchel's handshake. Okay. Oh, I've been told that Antonio Conte and Thomas Tuchel cannot be in the same building as each other. So we've sent their awards separately and I'll be accepting this one on their behalf. Mm, for me, Richarlison. Really? Yeah, Richarlison. It was uh, taken off his top that many times. Yeah, that was, yeah. was a bit it's ridiculous. It's got Richarlison. I mean, it's a funny moment, but... Is, yeah. But the Conte handshake is, is hilarious. It's so unnecessary. Yeah, if, you th if you're fully deep, you're like, what's the point? Two grown exactly. men. These men are two grown men yep. arguing about 11 players play kicking ridiculous. a ball. Like, talking about grown men, you've got Jack Grealish with his uh, Gucci bag. Yeah. All right, it's time for the next award. <laughs> and now for the Someone That's Not Haaland Best Player Award. The nominees are... Victor Ozerman. <laughs> Kevin De Bruyne. <laughs> and Martin Odegaard. And the winner is... Victor Ozerman. There's some great players here. Some great players, and I think it's well deserved. I mean, you think so? Oh, well deserved, man. Really? KDV, I mean, man. Clearly, For me, Odegaard, clearly you don't watch uh, Serie A, so it's crazy. Oh my god. Anyways, next up, Jules for the next award. Let's go. Next up, we have the Howler Award. The nominees are David De Gea. <laughs> Just Todd Bowley. And Man United losing 7-0 to Liverpool. <laughs> and the winner is...
Man United losing 7-0 to Liverpool. Oh, one sec. Unfortunately, Man United cannot be here. However, they still have one more trophy than Arsenal this season. I love it, mate. Don't be upset. You know, I'm not saying it. anything. It's crazy that the hair has somehow been nominated twice for Man U with Man United and clearly, we, clearly we've got a producer that doesn't like David De Gea for something. Yeah, yeah I don't know what's happening. A little there. bit biased. Yeah, but Man United losing seven 0 Yeah, it's got to be the winner. Yeah, of course. There's no one else it could be. It's time for the next award, ladies and gentlemen. Let's go. And the next award is someone that's not Haaland best young player. The nominees are Jude Bellingham. Enzo Fernandez and Pedri. And the winner is. Thank you, thank you, I'll take that, thank you. Yeah, rightly so. Jude Bellingham, everyone. Mm hmm, yep. Ah. Unfortunately, Jude couldn't be with us today, so he sent over his award to Madrid. Yeah, no, it's well deserved. Bellingham, yeah. I would have gone for Pedri. What well, shock you'd go for uh, Pedri, mate. Of course. Shock. How are you yeah. feeling though? Bellingham to Madrid. I mean, you know what? I feel like he's going to go to the best team in the universe. So oh. he's obviously, you know, it's going to make or break him. And hopefully it makes him. Anyways, yeah. next award, please. And now for the cold blooded award. And the nominees are Alan St. Maximan, <laughs> Ronaldo Blanks Carragher. And Conte tells Spurs how it is. And the winner is. <laughs> Alan St. Maximan. Yeah, that's brutal, though, man. There's no need for that. It's a bit too much, wasn't it? He is someone, man. someone give that goal. Newcastle top man. Oh, we gave her the She's award. Her award well. Yeah. She's better. Yeah, that's Goals true. The front three award. award is priceless. Exactly. Isn't it? Best thing you could yeah. get. That's bigger true. than the World Cup, I say. Next trophy <laughs> coming up next, ladies and gentlemen. Next up, we have someone that's not Haaland, best signing award. Our nominees are Kavaraskelia, <laughs> Lewandowski, <laughs> and Casemiro. And the winner is... <sighs> Kvaraskalia. I can't believe not Casemiro, to be honest. What? Yeah. So one won a league title, the other... Yeah, but look at the league. So yeah, yeah, yeah. Energy yeah. Cup. Casemiro. Right. I think he's changed. Casemiro has made. I think I've games. played more games than Casemiro. How many times has he been suspended? Please. Enough for you. Huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't want to Please. hear it from you. On to the next award. The next award is the most memeable person, aka the Jason Tinder Award. The nominees are David De Gea, <laughs> Richarlison, <laughs> and lastly, Jason Tindall. <laughs> and the winner is. Don't even need to open this. Yep, mm -hmm. as I thought, Jason Tindall. Um, our producer Nacho has got a slideshow of some Jason Tindall and Eddie Howe photos. Let's have a look at them. Oh, yeah. Oh, look at that. Just a copycat, isn't it? It's a bit ridiculous now. He's trying to be Eddie Howe. It's really sad. Oh, no. Wow, look Just at give that. Give him some space. It's mad. Yeah. Even the hairstyle oh. as well, get a little quiff. It's a bit ridiculous, come on. He's just been to our beef. Yeah, it? good turn there. Yeah. You can see it, yeah, nice. <laughs> I think it's beautiful to see, you know. He's imitating his heroes. On to the next award. Now, on to the best dressed award. And the nominees are Saeed Ben Rama. <laughs> Memphis Depay. <laughs> and Rafa Liao. <laughs> and the winner is. Memphis Depay. Great. Side Ben Rama. Side Ben Rama. Every day of the week. 
Memphis Depay should even be in the top three. Whoa, that's crazy. It's crazy. That's just the silliest thing I've ever heard. I mean, coming from the drip lord himself, I don't think it's silly. Yeah, you got a clip on Bowtie. Joke, man. One. Absolute I joke, man. Any honourable mentions then? Go on. You got Michael Elise, you got Joe Willock, the boys Of course. Come on. Shock, Real Madrid player. Of course. Not James any... Milner, you know, James Jordan Milner, Henderson, yeah. all them lot. Listen. James Milner. Crazy drip. Yeah. Listen, just because it's not branded doesn't mean it's bad. All right, it's time for the last award. Let's go. And finally, for the most important award, the Waffle Award. And the nominees are Yanni. Chuong. Shotgun Alley. Myself, Jules. And finally, David. And the winner is... Really? It's David. <laughs> Unfortunately, did... Oh, wait. No, I think we have him here. He is currently in Belgium having a waffle. So uh, he's got a special message for you guys. Well, guys, I'm very happy that I wasn't there to accept this award from uh, a delusional Arsenal fan that never won a European trophy, a Real Madrid fan from Bournemouth, and a Liverpool fan that didn't even manage to get top four. All I'm saying is that you hating on the things that I say. I was right about Newcastle, I was right about Brazil, I was right about several other things that you couldn't even fend them. But yeah, now it's time for me to rest because I know that the fans know who's the most knowledgeable of all of us. Front three should be the main striker right here. It's me. Hmm? <laughs> uh, personally, I thought Jules should have gone. Oh, 100%. That was rigged as well. Look, a man who has to sit here having the best football knowledge out of all of us. And the fact that you did not get the trophy, being a Liverpool merchant, sorry, it's a bit tight, um, a bit. is crazy, is absolutely crazy we, to you me. You know what, we never saw what was in that envelope. Yeah, it, could have, it probably was you, wasn't it? It was. Did you rig it? If I would have rigged it, I would have said you, Ali. Don't worry. Brilliant. Yeah. Why me? Because yeah, you think sure. Steven Gerrard's a good player. <laughs> but yeah, let's talk about the man himself, David, the winner of the award. Yeah, I mean, uh, he said Pi deserves to win a Ballon d'Or. You know yeah. with David, I feel, like, I feel like he's got a futuristic take with some I of the stuff. I think he's just so stupid, it's crazy. I, 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 I love him though. I think he's got a deal with Ronaldo that every time he mentions him and he says he's better than Messi, he gets like a commission. Yeah. It's it like must speaking be. to a five-year-old. Oh, wow. honestly. It's not nice, Addy. There you guys have it. That's our Front Threes Awards done. Congratulations to all our winners, especially to our very own David Koofy. It's time now to test our ball knowledge with who's in the box. Just a reminder, guys, we get given seven clues. Within those seven clues, we've got to guess what shirt's in the box. If you think you've got it, all you've got to do is shout it out. If you don't, sit down, mate. Once went undercover to watch a River Plate game. Is this you? Oh, my dad. Surely there's a... Oh, is this your dad? <laughs> <laughs> Only two people go to a River yeah. Plate game. Like, How are you going to go undercover? This? Made his debut at 16 years old. What are you saying? Could before? be anyone, mate. I haven't got a clue, got? mate. Who do you think? Have a guess. Uh, I'm not going to say yet because... No, you said you no, know you it. Said Just you have know. a guess. I said, I think... Take a risk, mate. Imagine if you won. I'm Maybe. not getting peer pressured. Only played two games with the senior national team. Clearly, he's bad. Ooh. Clearly, he's a bad player. I thought... Mm, oh, no. he's still 16. <laughs> oh. Lost one Europa League and four Copa del Rey finals. Can't be a Real Madrid player, then. Four Copa del... It's Atletico Madrid, surely. Coached Ooh. by Marcelo Bielsa. Hang on, is this Lorente? I don't know, mate. Why don't you have a look? Lorente. Oh. Right. You got it. Yeah, yeah, definitely. That's why I didn't take it out. Uh, he's got it wrong. You know what? I was, hey, I was, I was, I was close. Sit back down. Mate. I was close because I think they both played for the same team. You're yeah, the worst yeah. at this game. It's yeah. Hey, what's that extra clues in there? They're not gonna get that. One club man. You should be getting this. Bro, you didn't get it. You know, you, you've seen it, of course. You should be getting this. Shares first name with Spain's best goalkeeper ever. That's so bite. That's such a... That's just... What? Bro, you're Spanish. I know. I know the best keeper Iker. ever. Who is it? Iker. Yeah, it's got Iker. Yeah, he did. Oh, go ahead. Oh! Williams? Is no. that... Oh. Iker. Iker? Guess, guess. Is that a name? It's I don't know. Is that a name? It's absolutely not. <laughs> oh! Who plays for the same team, though? Wait, who's who's? Iker okay, um, I'm gonna take a guess. <laughs> it's, Finally, uh, after seven it's, clues, and with yeah. the first name, uh, is it Iker Munyain? Is it? Is it? Is it? <laughs> <laughs> it's not. 
That is. Hey! 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 Look at that. Beautifully. After beautifully seven done. clues, that's wow. crazy. Yeah, How are you, you feeling? Did you get mate? it? Huh? Did you get it? Anyways. Who did you guess? Huh? Yeah, silly. Yeah. I guessed. Yeah. Uh, silly. Don't worry. See, I knew it, but I like, I like, you know, taking my time. You know, why rush things when you know you're gonna win? There you guys have it. The show's come to an end. I've got to thank my boys Jules and Juan and producer Nacho. Don't worry, the football season's come to an end, but we're here all summer. See you guys next week. <laughs>